Hey everyone, don't mind the hot mess because I actually just got through working out and something told me call the hospital. So I did, right? And I call and they're like, nobody's in bed six. And I'm like, what? Where is he? You know, so I had a little bit of a, you know, panic attack. I'm like, hold on, let's look. <laughs> so anyway, the hospital moved Robert to the other side of the hospital. Um, he's in, I believe, I am you, I want to say. Um, anyway, I'm not going to give the room number and all that on here. If anybody wants the room number, they will have to message me. But um, he was moved. And now here comes, see, I got more messages coming in now because everybody's like asking questions. So he was moved and they moved him in the wee hours of the morning. That's why I wasn't called. Um, they said that he is stable. He's not really in any danger anymore. Just, um, you know, still not awake. Okay. And not responding to much. He is responding somewhat when they like wash his face and different things like that. Um, he's breathing on his own except for they've got him on oxygen. So he's no longer on the life support. He does have a feeding tube because right now he can't eat, you know. Um, and I asked them if they had done an EEG. And the, the nurse said that he would have to look through the paperwork. He doesn't know. And so I requested if they haven't done one to do one. Because I want to know how much brain activity he's got. Um, I'm looking to see him wake up sooner or later. Um, you know, God's in control. And, uh, hey, Jen. Hey, Danielle. So, you know, I'm looking that he's going to wake up because he is responding some even though they keep saying he's not really responding well to me any little bit is responding okay so um yeah i mean you guys i, I was like jumping for joy i was doing my exercises and it stopped right in the middle and i was like call the hospital and so i did and all of a sudden, I'm just dancing all over the place. And I wish I could play music right now. I'd be dancing to the music, you know. But you know how Facebook is about daggum music. Anyway, regardless, I wanted to give you all the update. Let you all know what was going on. Hey, Robin. Thanks for talking with me last night. I really, really appreciate you. I really, really do. There's been a lot of people that have been supporting me and Robert and a lot that haven't but that's okay you know um it is what it is like I told you last night I'm not gonna let it eat my lunch so um anyway I want to show you and I'm not going to show you the the other part of it but I will show you this part and I'm not going to hold it up too close because of the fact that there's information on here that no one needs to have um, let me see if I can cover it. Hold on. Let me put my glasses on. One second, you guys. Because I'm going to tell you what happened. Alright, yeah. I can cover that up. Okay. This is the POA. Real quick glance. Because y'all don't need all that information. Anyway. The hospital will not take it. And they won't take it simply because of the fact that it was not drawn up by an attorney. It was just he and I filling it out and then it was notarized. So a notarized copy is not good enough for them. It is for the VA, but not for the hospital. Go figure. So anyway, they're really not giving me a hard time right now um, they're keeping me informed, um, you know, letting me know everything that's going on with him. And they are going to start physical therapy with him. Um, they're going to have a therapist come in and, you know, do exercise his legs and his arms and that sort of thing. 
So, you know, because he's laying in the bed. Um, and to keep him flexible and all of that. Say hey. Hi. So, um, yeah, I mean, and, oh, this is what I wanted to tell you. So, when I went up to the VA yesterday, this is his social worker right here. She gave me this. And this is basically um, Veterans Lone Star Legal. Okay? And they are at the Michael E. DeBakey VA Medical Center Monday through Friday. Or I can call them. And I've got a phone call into them right now. She told me they will possibly help me get what I need to be able to give to the hospital, um, draw up the paperwork as his guardian, you know, or whatever. And um, so I'm excited about that too. And do it for free because he's a veteran and this is veterans help. This is veterans law. Um, so anyway, all good news, all good news, all good news. Praise Jesus. Um, so yeah, don't put that over here. That's my personal stuff. Nice. People don't need to see that. Click that back on there I, right now. I, you don't ever show people personal stuff. That has all my information on it. Kids, they don't know, right? <laughs> anyway, I'm going to let y'all go. I just wanted to give you a quick update. Bye if bye. you got any questions, post them below, and I will answer you back. Love you guys. Keep praying. Keep praying.